It's time for another Dirt Daily, and today I'm going to introduce you to a little project truck that I drug home. Um, do you recall there was a Dirt Every Day where we rescued a K5 Blazer? We called it Mr. Brown Pants. We drug it around on a trailer and tried to make it run, and we failed. We failed miserably. That thing never ran. Well, for some reason, that thing got me excited about K5 Blazers, and I brought home Mr. Khaki Pants. This is a 1983 K5 Blazer. It has a 305 V8 and a four-speed manual transmission. It's pretty good. Um, it used to have a stereo and it doesn't anymore, which some people care about. I don't care. Uh, it has a four-speed manual, probably an SM 465. Has like the original black vinyl seats. Um, the driver's seat has a couple cracks in it. Um, rust is pretty non-existent. There's a little bit right here on this seam, but it looks like somebody had tried to paint it. The floor on this thing is really solid. You can look up underneath there. No holes. Like, this is a California truck. It's got some garbage wiring, like you can see right there. Some sort of electrical mess was going on. Um, probably the worst part about it is the hard top is kind of like deteriorating from being out in the sun. The old window tint needs removed. The headliner needs replaced. Um, the dash is got a little crack underneath there. Let's look under the hood. Now there's a dent right there. There's a dent right there. But like the front bumper looks like it's only run into something a little bit right there. Uh, you can see this fender's got a little ding dong in it. And then this side, also pretty solid. It's got some Patagonia mud tires on it with lots of tread. Um, no rot down along here. And if you look up underneath, this side is also very solid. There's a little dent in the back corner. You can see the tailgate's got a couple cracks in it. Under the hood. It's, uh, I believe, a 305. Battery tie down. Um, it has some of the air conditioning parts, but I don't know that it's all hooked up or if it's working. Um, most of the smog stuff is there. This may have been a manual, I mean, an automatic truck before. Like some of the steering column stuff is there, and there's some sort of cooler on the front of the radiator. Like maybe a trans cooler was up in here, or something that has been deleted or disconnected. Um, but it's definitely manual trans pedals and everything. Let's see how it runs. Look at that. This thing starts, starts right up. A little bit of smoke, but not terrible. A trailer hitch on the back. There's definitely some exhaust leakage in this corner, but um, I put a new fuel pump on it. I put a new 
hood release cable on it. So there you have it. Mr. Khaki Pants is up for sale. Um, maybe wondering why did I get this thing and now I'm already selling it. Well, the fact is, is that I kind of got excited about it and then I realized I really don't need another project. I have way too many. This thing runs and drives. This would be a great first truck for somebody that wants a four x four. It's an 83. So in the state of California, you're gonna have to smog it but maybe in your state, you don't need to do that. Uh, I'm asking $6,999 for this truck. And I think it's worth all of that because these things are getting to be crazy expensive these days. Uh, I'm gonna take it for a little spin, but if you want it, send me a message um, at my 4 by Fred Williams at Gmail email or fred at 4 by Fred Williams.com or Fred at Dirt Every Day. Any of those places, send me a message if you wanna buy this thing. It's pretty rad. to mention I have a brand new headliner for it maybe I'll do an install that's for this dirt daily we'll talk to you guys next time